Hey, what is up guys? My name is Akalti and today I'm going to be showing you how to make your own Firewatch themed iPhone at under Android or paper. So sorry for not uploading for years. I was busy and now I am also busy. But I just have enough time to record the video for you guys. So before we get started with the tutorial, don't forget to leave a like. And without further ado, let's get started with the tutorial. So as you can see right here in my Photoshop, it looks like uh, you can see it's a really unique uh, wallpaper for Firewatch. And as you can see right here, it's in instead of uh, Firewatch, it says Psychology. So uh, you can assume that you can type anything like this. You can edit edit this, yeah, <laughs> like like so. And yeah, with, in this tutorial, I'm going to show sh I'm going to be showing you how to do so. And yeah, let's get started with the tutorial. So first of all, we're going what you're going to do is to click new and uh, it's the preset and the resolution is seven. 50 and uh, 1334 and yeah blah 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 color mode is R RGB click ok I already have the preset right here ok click ok and here's your canvas and next what you're going to do is to uh, search in Google on Google for a wallpaper like Firewatch wallpaper you can also uh, search for maybe a Firewatch wallpaper iPhone and um, yeah, it, it, as you can see right here, it also has uh, a wide range of selection. But let's go with the with just uh, the Firewatch wallpaper. And as you can see right here, there are so many of them. And uh, let's pick this one because it's the most mainstream wallpaper that <laughs> yeah, pretty much everywhere. Oh, I forgot. Click this uh, triangle. On the Chrome and then show in folder and then you can see right here is the JPEG open your Photoshop again go to your folder and then just drag and drop to your canvas and BAM there you go so scale it up until uh, yeah your desired size and yeah well there's there you go there's your uh, wallpaper yeah it's not finished yet as you can see right here there's no text and yeah so yeah we're not even close as you can see right here is the there's a shield and the text and what you're going to do is to download this uh, PSD file so once you've got your uh, PSD file just drag this uh, while your uh, while this layer is selected just drag and drop from the PSD file to the uh, uh, new, new, what is the new, new file. So there you go, it's here. And next, what you're going to do is to uh, click the T here for the text tool, and click in the middle, and make sure the alignment is in the center. And uh, for the font, I'm going to just leave the link. In the description it, this is a very very identic font or maybe it's a uh, same exact font that it's being used in the uh, firewatch logo and yeah click this one and for for example just use something like a username there you go click OK of course it's sick and move it a little bit, a bit down so yeah that's it you can pretty much uh, re uh, change the color to any other color <laughs> okay uh, for example it's white for instance or maybe even this kind of color a bit orange it's pretty cool click OK and the change the text as well and BAM there you go uh, for some for the detail, I'm going to uh, add some grunge textures. Change the blending mode 
to soft light or oh, not soft light maybe um lighten or no is there a like a lighter color or linear dodge yeah linear dodge so as you can see right here it's a bit like a paper and lower down the opacity and voila okay so yeah that's pretty much how you uh create a iphone wallpaper with the firewatch theme with your own uh, style with your own name i guess yes and uh, we should want to save this uh save this project <laughs> project save this design uh, save as and then just save it in png file like firewatch F -f firewatch iphone iphone da, 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 da. wp okay there you go click ok and go to your go to your folder of your psd files and stuff and as you can see it's really really well made so yeah that's pretty much that's pretty much it i guess if you really like this tutorial and you find this tutorial is really helpful and the design is really really cool and you really like this the kind of design is just a, just a simple and basic skills uh, but you love it love it anyway just please leave a like and leave a comment for a feedback and maybe even subscribe for more tutorial videos and design videos so yeah my name is Akalati and I'm signing out